What's up guys? Welcome back to my collection channel. Today I have a very mystical collectible. This collectible is something a lot of people collect. Um, it's very popular. It's pretty much a worldwide thing already. If Even if you don't know what it is, you know what it is. It's taking over the world. For a while people have were obsessed. I mean people kind of still are obsessed over this particular thing and it's just a, a huge thing in the collectible community and it's also what kind of prompted my whole collectible journey I suppose uh this is gonna look very very beat up because I've uh I've had it for a while and I I didn't want to open it for some reason and now I'm kind of grateful I didn't quote unquote open it because the box is open it's the it's crushed it's a you know very horrible condition and i'm also not a kind of collector where i want everything like perfect some of these things are going to have damage some of these things are not going to be in working order and that's okay it's just for me it's not like i'm a i'm trying to be like this huge collector in the collection community but we we're gonna get right into it and see if y'all guys like it before we start i just want to say subscribe you know just a little reminder in there just to subscribe it doesn't cost nothing because y'all want y'all gonna want to be part of this collectible uh adventure and just subscribe we join the collective family now let's get into it. What I have for y'all today is this beat up mystical Pokemon box. As y'all can see, Celebi's right front and center, the little pins right there. And I know, I know the box is very beat up. This box actually, if I remember right, was given to me by a friend back in my first job he had it in the back of his car and you know i i used to talk about pokemon to him and he knew i like pokemon so he's like you want this i don't really have any use for it he he wasn't really into the whole thing and i i was like yes i want it so he gave it to me and i never opened it it was in the back of my car and it was in my closet it was on my floor in front of my bed. I've, it's been all over my house. It's been all over my car. I've looked at it many times I've, and I've never actually opened it. So let's actually open it and admire what's inside. You know, packaging is, like I said, a bit broken down. It's been all over the place. So let's open it. uh the inside packaging is not too beat up it's it's okay the celebi is kind of coming out um this is all beat up so we're not going to use this no more this is probably going to trash um so take this plastic off if i can the sun did infuse the two plastic together in my car Oh, and there's the the front card, Celebi, right there. Let's see. It's moves for Time Call and Leech Seed. Cool. And let's set this right to the side. And if y'all play this online card game, uh, at the end I'm a I'm gonna put the code in in there. You know, I'm gonna show you the code. Uh, you know what? Just here. Let me show you the code right now. There's the code. If y'all play this game, I I try to get into it. I played it for a bit and then I stopped. I like playing with the actual cards better. So let's go with the pen first. The pen is not damaged surprisingly at all. Like there's no damage that I see. Oh, oh no, that looks like a like a production damage not not a, me abusing the 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 budget whatever out of it um but you know 
It's not too bad. It's I like it. Uh, Celebi, not my favorite Pokemon. Uh, it's cute. I don't actually use it in game. The only time I actually liked it was whenever I watched the the movie. Uh, forgot what it was called. But I'm I'm pretty sure y'all everybody knows this movie. You know the Celebi one and and everything. Whenever Celebi creates this huge Celebi forest creature after it was captured with the dark bonds and 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 things. Now. We're going to open, oh, and this one's already open on its own. It ripped on its own. Uh, you can see from all, the, all the sun, it's been <laughs> discolored a bit. It's open already because all the abuse I, I did to it. And let's get right into it. Uh, I don't really know that card trick where they like put the cards in front and have the special card. And it's like three or, or something. Uh, one, two, three. Let's let's try that. Uh, let's try three. Uh, I should have probably done more research. Let's get into into it. So the first one is Charmander. Charmander is actually a uh, a favorite as is a lot of people he was actually the first one i've ever chose whenever i got the, the first game the i actually played the the very first game you know uh pokemon red and i was like red of course i gotta go with the fire pokemon and back then i didn't really know pokemon as much as i know now so I didn't have that whole hype of Charizard and everything, but I grew up with, with Charmander, Charmeleon, and Charizard. They were my, my buddy on the other side. Next one is a trainer card, a supporter card. It's called Olymp Olympia. You know, uh, I whenever I played the, the trainer card game, I didn't really use these. The trainer cards, I I didn't really use them. I, back then, I didn't even know how, how they worked. Um, I barely even knew how to play the game. So, let's put that there. The next one's another trainer card is uh, item card, Max Revive. And I'm pretty sure these come in handy. This is, is what, put a Pokemon from your discarded pile on top of your deck. So see, you could have uh, taken a Pokemon from your deck and put it back one that was discarded already and you maybe you like that card you like playing with it and you can put it back on to your deck next one is one that i think my sister actually had a plushie of this clefairy the fairy pokemon not my favorite either my sister liked it it was it was cute and cuddly and stuff um like i said i think she, i believe she had one of these Plushies, but I don't really remember. Uh, the next one is a Diglett. Diglets, I never actually pay much attention to them. At times, I actually forget they even exist until I play the games or watch the thing. And whenever I'm trying to think of Pokemon, I'm like, who is this Pokemon? And then I'm like, oh yeah. Uh, next one's an energy. Nothing special, just a water energy. Uh, next one is the most OP Pokemon there is in Pokemon. Magikarp. Yep, the most OP Pokemon. Hits you with that, that epic splash, and you're done for. <laughs> I actually used Magikarp back in the day. Uh, I remember that was the first fish I've ever caught in Pokemon, and... I was like, I'm going to train this Pokemon. I'm going to evolve it. I didn't know it evolved into a Gyarados. But when it did, I was like, oh, snap. Uh, Gyarados was actually another companion I used to take with me back in the day. Uh, I still play it. Actually, on my phone, I have the game. The next one is an item trainer card. The Pokeball. And I don't know. I, I'm not a big 
Pokemon collection um, person, so I'm not like I don't. I think this is called a reversed hollow or or something. It's one of those shiny cards. One of those in the back. Oh, I guess it was four cards that I needed to do. This one was my favorite. This one was another. This is probably my most the favorite out of the whole game. Um, you know, from Gen 1 to, I don't know what Gen they are right now. I actually don't watch uh, Sun and Moon and I haven't played the games. So I actually don't know the Pokemon at all from that era. Um, but Gengar. Gengar was my boy. Whenever I caught him, I caught a Ghastly. You know, I was like, oh snap, this is going to be my favorite Pokemon. And then it evolved to a Hunter. I was like, it just got cooler. And then I evolved it into a Gengar, and I was like, hands down, my most favorite Pokemon. And it has been. It hasn't changed, and it's probably not going to change. The next one, it's it's been in the movie too. I I don't really like the movie. It's not one of those movies I really liked. It, it was semi boring to me. Uh, actually, I forget this Pokemon exists at times as well, just like Diglett, but even more. I believe it's a legendary Pokemon. Is, is this a legend? I think so, yeah. Uh, Jirachi. And it's a, what, a reverse holo or holo? I don't know what it is. It's a shiny only in the background. Oh, actually, the whole thing is shiny. That's a little shiny in the picture, in the, in the background of the attacks and stuff. Uh, Jirachi, not very, my very favorite one. It's not very, a, a very huge pull. That Gengar, though, was pretty good to me, even though it might not be a good part of the collection or something. Um, but let's open the next one. So here's the next packet. It's also open. Um, I saw the first card. But, yeah, let's get into it and see what we have so let's do four cards this time one two three uh no i think it's three cards i just saw the the, the card i think that was supposed to be another i think it's two cards in the back so let's see this is part of the the era that i didn't really watch I know it has an evolution uh, this is the the basic well it says right here basic but I don't really know this I think this is from black and white I stopped at uh, diamond and pearl so I don't really know after that um, it's Esper I don't really know this Pokemon power is twinkle and it just puts Pokemon to sleep the next one's pretty good. He he would be in my in my buddy system, you know, my my top six that I used to take every time I, I go out and play. Try to catch them all, you know, train them because it's my cause and it's my choke. He I, I actually the next one is an item card. Uh, a trainer it's called maintenance I don't really know what it does uh, I'm not gonna read it uh, the next one is though duo it's based on the Kiwi I've actually seen an animation of a Kiwi uh, it's sad it's it's a good animation you should you should watch it you should put Kiwi animation and it's pretty sad but it's a good animation then ghastly is the next one the basic evolution of my boy Gengar. The next one uh, was one of those Pokemon Ash Ketchum had, but it was very tiny from what I remember. Krabby. I didn't really play with him just in the beginning whenever I first caught him. Uh, the next one is just an energy guard, the water energy, nothing really special. Uh, next one is a. Hollow, I think. A trainer, supporter, Pokemon Center lady, Hillster. 
your Pokemon. And then there is this little cute one. Uh, I, I never gone this far. I think it's from Black and White. Uh, I don't know many Pokemon from there. Uh, I just know the ones I've caught from Pokemon Go. I don't really know much of them. Um, it's called De Dene? Dene? Sounds like Dende from Dragon Ball. And then, ooh, the last one. The last one looks pretty cool. This one, people used to talk about it, but it just, you used to talk about it mostly because of Naruto, because he was the Nine Tails, just like this one. I like, I, I used to like it. It was a fire Pokemon. Uh, you can't really get many fire Pokemon games, so uh, you know, having another fire Pokemon. Whenever I caught Vulpix and evolving, it, it was, it was pretty nice. That is it for today. The this was a pretty, pretty fun um opening i like opening these packets uh and we, we have the first thing that we are going to set up on our shelf and it's going to be the, the little celebi pen we're going to put it right here right there right on the shelf eventually i will get the pen uh backs where i can uh collect all the pens i have um but for right now that's gonna stay there and it's gonna be the first thing on the shelf of the collectibles and it looks nice uh, finally starting my shelf after you know a while but that's gonna be all for today if y'all liked the video give it a huge thumbs up and if y'all want to join the collective family Hit subscribe and join the collective family and watch as we grow the the collection of this show. As y'all can see, Celebi is the first thing. Uh, and this is y'all's collection as well. So leave a comment below as what I should do next. Uh, I have some ideas. I, I'm going to bring them next time. And I hope y'all have a wonderful day. See y'all next time.